What's going on guys, it's Aryan and I'm back at it again with another video. And in today we got a special unboxing of a pretty special Apple product if you ask me. So basically the new 14 and 16 inch M1 Max and M1 Pro MacBooks have been super, super popular the past year. So this is actually the refurbished model of the M1 Max 14 inch MacBook Pro. As you can see from the box, it's a little bit different than a normal MacBook Pro would be. So we're gonna be taking a look at if it's worth buying a refurbished MacBook Pro. Now, on Apple's website, they say that the refurbished models have been through a bunch of testing and there's nothing really wrong with them at all. So we're gonna be putting that to the test in this video. We're gonna be unboxing it. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of the differences of like the box, what it comes with. I'm pretty sure it comes with the ex exact same things, but we're gonna be going through that. And uh, basically, so if you were to buy this exact MacBook on the Apple website for a normal price, here in Canada, you'd be paying $4,149. Now this MacBook, the refurbished model, in the exact same spec. So by the way, this is the 14 inch M1 Max processor in this. So it has a 10 core CPU with a 32 core GPU, 32 gigabytes of RAM, one terabyte SSD, space gray. And this one will run you 3539. So you're pretty much saving $600 here in Canada before tax. So without any further ado, let's just get right to the unboxing of this machine. Okay, so looking at the box, the refurbished model is, as you can see, super different than the normal MacBook Pro box. Now, it's pretty much blank. There's no image of the MacBook Pro. All it says is MacBook Pro here, and it says Apple certified refurbished. It's like as simple of a box as you can get. So just something to note, if you're reselling it, that might be a big deal to you. If you're not, it doesn't really matter. Peeling off the top, let's just get right into the unboxing. Same sort of uh, peel as the normal MacBooks. Let's get this plastic wrap out. And we can just slide up the lid. And basically the exact same presentation as a regular MacBook with obviously MacBook at the top. Let's just take that out for a sec. Cannot see any differences right off the bat. Looks pretty much the same to me. And in the box, you get your MagSafe connector and looks pretty much brand new. Like, yeah, it is brand new. So no issues there. Uh, you obviously get your paperwork. You get your wall outlet and again, brand new. Taking a look at some of the paperwork that you get inside the box. MacBook Pro, you get some Apple stickers, right? Yeah. Oh, black Apple stickers, nice. Cool, cool, cool. And yeah, everything is basically exactly the same as it would be if you were buying just a brand new MacBook. All right, now, taking a look at the MacBook itself, like I said, 14 inch MacBook Pro, space gray. Let's just peel the plastic right off. This is probably the most satisfying thing to do in an Apple product. I just, I don't know, I love this. Now quickly taking a look at the exterior of the MacBook Pro, it is brand new. Yeah, like I literally cannot see anything that indicates that this is a refurbished model. Like you would never know, aside from the box, from the outside, like I can't see like, there's no scratches, there's no blemishes, literally nothing. Looks absolutely brand new. So let's just open it up for the first time. Obviously you get the little screen thing. Screen looks brand new. So I'm gonna get this set up and then I'm gonna kind of give you guys my little initial impressions and a little bit more about the refurbished model in general and why I think that it's actually an amazing deal for people to be getting the refurbished models of laptops, especially from Apple. Okay, so now that the Mac is all set up and literally I cannot find any differences compared to a normal new MacBook Pro. Like, like the more I think about it, the refurbished model is actually like a super, super good deal because you're saving like 600 bucks and the reason why I think it's even a better deal is because you can add Apple Care to a refurbished Apple MacBook Pro and it's the exact same as it would be for any other Apple Care product. So if anything goes wrong, if you have like damage, software issues, whatever, you take it to the store, you get it replaced, you get it fixed, all the issues are all the stuff that comes with Apple Care. Now you're getting it on a refurbished model and you've already saved so much money. So buying Apple Care is kind of like a no brainer for this. And obviously no way I'm sponsored or anything. I'm just thinking that it's actually a good idea. So that's it really like the refurbished MacBook Pro, I think is a great deal. Uh, I'm gonna do some more videos on this computer 
and stay tuned for that but as of now yeah like i'm really happy with the refurbished one like it's a great buy so i recommend it to anybody who wants to just save a little bit of money go for the refurbished because uh you won't go wrong with it